channel mainly you can see a lot of cardiology contents which includes ecg echo then coronary angiogram basic and advanced views and a lot of echo case presentation also so in this video mainly i am covering like how i become a cardiac sonographer so mainly i am a cardiac sonographer from india i am currently working in uae so uh, the course which i have completed is a bachelor course and i have done my registration in um, cardiac credentialing international rcs i have done the my examination i am uh, graduated uh, then so in this video we'll see like what are the steps to become a cardiac sonographer and what field you are up to and what cases you have to follow during your um, career and what uh, kind of registration you have to do that kind of videos i'll do in this my through my youtube channel so first of all uh, so i told you like uh, i'm a graduate so i have uh, done a bachelor course in this so there is a diploma and uh, there is a bachelor course which is available in the india so if you are interested in an echocardiography if you uh, you can select a bsc cardiac technology or a cardiovascular technology uh, or if you are into a cardiothoracic uh, profession you can select the cardio pulmonary profession cppt course then if you are into a cath lab person if you are completely a cath lab person means you can study if either you can study a bsc cardiac technology which includes um, in india i'm telling you which is a three years close uh, plus one year internship so in the third year uh, you have you will have a cath lab posting and second year you will have an echo posting also so uh, coming to your career you can select whatever the options you want either echo or the cath lab then otherwise you can do a diploma in cath lab also so um, the main uh, differentiation is um, that in diploma we will finish our course as soon as possible and uh, for the bsc like uh, it will take a lot of time and we'll have a lot of like log books and the next exam and all so a little bit stressful compared to the diploma how the bsc people are and after that if you want to do a masters in the echocardiography or in the coronary intervention interventions there are a lot of options which is available in india coming to the uk and the usa and all there are a lot of associated programs are there in echocardiography which we can do after a masters or mphil or whatever we want we have to apply uh, through the university so that is the main thing to a echocardiogram course or doing a course so um this is an introduction video for them so if you guys don't know about the course i'll tell you some little bit um like from my experience from my little experience i'll tell you some tips so um uh, i am selected this course before um, because i like the medical field and i like to study cardiologists so that's why mainly i um i prefer this course and why i choose echo means we can interpret a lot of things and we can do a lot of qualifications we can give the reports so it's give us a lot of opportunity and a lot of exposure so that is the main thing and the person who are coming here i'm telling you so once you are into a cardiac technology or a cardiovascular programs uh, so you are in a medical field and i uh, think you guys won't have any regular shift duties like and no any weekly of of like we don't have any regular routines we have to cover on calls we have to do the night duties day duty posting and all so before coming to the programs first you have to get adapt we have to adapt our minds before coming to the uh, before we are taking this programs and uh, we have to cover a lot of like basic subjects like uh, mainly in other medical programs we have like physiology anatomy biochemistry pharmacology pathology and all the first year basic subjects we have to cover uh, we have to cover and coming to the second year and the third year we have to uh, do we have to study the echocardiograms and sometimes we will get a, a chance to do the echoes also and we can see the patient hearts so that is the main one of the biggest happiness we'll get from our job we can see the patient heart okay uh, then we can interpret the ecgs and not even echo we can do the halter reporting and all we can do from this course 
ओके सो इफ यू आर ग्रेजुएटिंग फ्रॉम एक अंडर एक कोर्स मीन्स सो फर्स्ट मेक श्योर दैट जस्ट कॉन्टैक्ट विद द सीनियर्स और हु आर द पर्सन हु आर कॉन्टेक्टेड फ्रॉम द यूनिवर्सिटी देन सो डोंट रिमेंबर टू डू ए कोर्स रजिस्ट्रेशन आफ्टर यूर कंप्लीशन सो इफ यू आर इन टू इंडिया और सम अदर प्लेसेस सो फॉर अस Uh, compared to the UK and US and all, we don't have any option to do a direct uh, RCS examination or a RDMS examination through um, through our university in the during our studies. So uh, whenever finish, whenever we are finishing our course, if you are if you are getting a one year experience or a two years experience, we can do a re registration, international registration by ourselves. So this will help. us to uh, improve ourselves so that is the first thing so you can do a registration mail you so i will post two videos in which one uh, how we will uh, do our registration for the rcs course uh, and for uh, cardiac credentialing international and rdms also like i have done only rcs so whatever the knowledge i have i'll do i'll do a video based upon that uh, regarding rdms i have only some knowledge but i'll do some reference also and i'll try to upload a video for the rdms uh, qualification also then uh, then in my next video one more video uh, i'll try to post in which i'll uh, give you a list of colleges or paramedical courses in which we can join a cardiac sonographer or a cardiac technology course in india mainly okay so if you guys like my channel uh, please do a like share and subscribe and uh, don't forget to watch my previous videos also echocardiogram views you uh, views and um, you will get a lot of cardiology contents like cat lab and ecg interpretation i have already posted in my channel so don't forget Uh, do a like share and subscribe thank you stay tuned